What up, CTR family? It's that time again. We're getting ready to drop off one of the, the puppets. This time, this one is going to Wisconsin, so we headed to the airport. Uh, we done filled up, filled up the United States map and working on the outside of the country. We got a few dogs outside the country. Very proud of that. Uh, uh, so, with that being said, this, this video can kind of be about shipping and whatnot, man. Uh, we ship any kind of way, any way that you can think of, we do it. And if we ain't thought of it or thunk of it or done it, we will do alternate ways, ways that we haven't done before. You just have to mention them to us and let us know. There's it's, it's lots of ways to get them out there. Uh, we still do not allow people to come out to the house uh, for reasons I mentioned in the past. Uh, <clears throat> but, uh, like I said in one of the other videos in the past, the best way to... Uh, I think and the most efficient way to ship a dog is for you to fly in. Let me cut this heat down. It's for you to fly in and then uh, pick up the dog and fly back, which is what this couple has did. They flew in from Wisconsin uh, and they're flying back today. They'll be here four hours. And four hours is not a long time. By the time I get there to you and uh, you get the dog and y'all get something to eat, take a walk. You'll be in and out, and it'll be right back. It'll be time for you to start boarding back on the plane. Uh, this airport is Adamsville, uh, Bill and Clinton, Hillary, K L L Q. Now, K L I T, if you want to look it up, uh, are, are Bill Clinton and Hillary Clinton in Arkansas. So, the airport is real small. You can get in and get in and out of there real easy. You don't go through one, it's not like one of the major airports in Dallas. Uh, in Atlanta where you got to walk a million different places. I think it's only one or two terminals at this airport uh, But so it's real easy to get there. Uh, the next way would probably be just to have somebody bring it to you We do have a shipper that'll bring it to you uh, Her fees is gonna cost you just about as much as it will uh, For you to put the dog on the plane uh, And I'm just being honest. Uh, she got to make her living too But one thing that she does offer and that I love that she offers is the pay later option with the, with the airlines, it ain't no pay later option, but with her, it is a pay later option. Where are you trying to go, Lamont? Where are you trying to go? So with the airlines, it's no pay option. With her, it is a pay option. So you can you can put up a you can put a little down payment down or none at all. Get the dog, have her bring it to you, and then uh, uh, pay later on. You know, a little bit of uh, monthly increments. Now it's not in house financing, but it is financing that she allows. Uh, for that situation and we will be doing that here soon man i've been trying to get it done it takes a little time but we're gonna get that done uh what was it? what's the other thing and then the other option is is we can just put the dog on the plane itself uh, you can put it on the plane up under the plane and be considered cargo cargo at that point there's restrictions those restrictions are based on each individual airline so you have to call them and configure that i don't know all the information for each one i can help you with a few but for the most part, you got to call them and get that information. Uh, and then you can also uh, have a, a air nanny carry. I mean, that's the same thing. You essentially <laughs> flying down and picking up the pup. But instead of instead of you flying down and picking up the pup, you pay somebody to do it. Now, that's one of the more expensive ways. But it's just, it's dang near similar to same day service. Uh, that person, y'all set up a date. When it's paid for, the dog gets you the same day or the next day. It's just effort. But you pay for that. And then the, probably the most inefficient way is I get asked all the time, will we deliver? Yeah, we will deliver or we will meet you, but it's not for free. And that's just what it is because it's a business. Uh, you have to pay me for my time, that I'm away from the kennel. Well, somebody got to take care of these dogs. Nolan don't want to do it by itself. You want to do it by yourself? No. All right, so somebody got to pay for these dogs. So me, personally, if you ask me to come out, I'm just going to be honest with you. And I'll tell you when I talk to you, it ain't no hard feelings, but it's going to cost you. Um, one time I had to take a dog. I'm just telling y'all so you'll know. One time I took a dog up to, uh, 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 what was it, Boston. Every bit of $2,500 just for me to go up there. And you, so it was an emergency situation, but that's what it, that's what it costs to take that dog up there. Um, so this is all I wanted to let y'all know. Uh, those are your shipping options. Little mama's getting ready to head out. To a new home, she reminds me of Dallas. She's full of energy. This is the Apollo little uh, one of the girls, one of two girls, full of energy. She looks more like her dad. The other one looks more like her mom, her grandmother. Uh, so, man, I can't.
could have kept all three. Like I always say, man, I could have kept all three. Uh, Till next time, y'all. If y'all got any questions, make sure y'all like, subscribe, and also, also, not only like and subscribe, make sure you go down there to that setting button on the bottom right and hit that button and put it on HD. Take it off of that 360p and use that HD, that 8K, and use it so you can see the real quality of these rock walks. Till next time. See you.